Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Sorry, I'm just staring at what I have in my hand. Um, today, we're gonna be doing a everyday natural, get ready with me, natural, eh, not really. It's currently raining at the moment. It is, it's a nice day. I feel like my um, high school self would love this weather, but at the moment, I'm not feeling it. Like I just want sunshine, happiness, good photo lighting. You know what I mean? You can see my ears. <laughs> Wait, let's fix this. Yeah, no, yeah. Okay, so we're gonna start with primer. So you can use moisturizer if you'd like, but these primers are going to actually do stuff for my skin. Like moisturizer will just kind of make your skin moisturized. I don't wanna sound like a dickhead that doesn't know what they're talking about. So anyway, let's just get started. So I'm gonna be using the Porefessional. So most of these things are drugstore, but this is high end. Um, this I got for my birthday, I didn't even get it for myself. But, and then I have the L'Oreal Lumi Magic. The packaging is kind of rubbed off. Um, this is gonna be for obviously blurring my pores like here. And then this is gonna be for the outer bit of my face where I want some glow. So I normally like to start with the Porefessional. I'm gonna use the viewfinder as my mirror. Then I'm gonna take the Lumi Magic Primer. I'm gonna put a little bit onto my finger and then kind of use it everywhere else that I didn't really use the other primer and make sure that you go like on your cheekbones and if you want to add a bit more add a bit more to the places that you want to be extra glowy but that's all I'm going to do and then we're going to move on to eyebrows so do I have a mirror in any of these compacts? Because I kind of need it for my eyebrow. I do. So I'm going to use this mirror. I'm just going to brush my eyebrow hairs up. Just like that. And then the product that I use, I've been using for a while now. It's called the Brow Satin by Maybelline. And it just looks like this. Now. We are going to move on to the face. So what I like to use um, on days that's just like casual, I will use the Chi Chi Super CC Cream with caviar extract and 30 skin conditioning agents. Long name, I know. <laughs> but just the Chi Chi CC Cream. I use the shades medium to tan because I only ever really use this stuff when I am tanned. It's so lovely. I like to apply this with, a, what's it called? A beauty blender. So this is my beauty blender and I just, when I'm just really lazy and can't be bothered to go to the bathroom and wet my beauty blender, I'll just spray it with some Mario Badescu because it's basically just water anyway. <laughs> so the pump on it is so like annoying. I've had it, this one for a while and I just like am over it. Just take a bit of the CC cream, pump a bit onto my finger and just dot it all over my face. I took this on holidays with me and I probably will again because I'm going on holiday again this year. Um, and this was all I used. I don't think I used foundation once. It's just like so ideal. It's so light on your skin and it just does the job. So I take the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind, um, holy grail forever. I go from using this or the Maybelline Fit Me, but I find this to be a bit better. I'm gonna just take the Beauty Blender. Next up, I'm gonna be using a really, really good product. Well, a product that I really like at the moment. It's the Rimmel Insta duo contour stick and it just looks like this it has highlighter on one end and contour on the other end and i've used this to death so i'm just going to take the contour part and put it everywhere we'd normally contour and i just use this kind of as a contour and also as a bronzer because i can't really be bothered with powdered bronzer at the moment 
And then I just use a brush to blend this in. I just find that it works a bit easier. Okay, so once that's all blended, I just like to go in with a bit of um, this Maybelline Fit Me powder. And I just like to set my under eyes because they crease. And that's all I set. Even though by the time I get to it, it's already creased anyway. And then what I do is I go in with the Rimmel Contour Stick again and I use the highlighter side and I just draw on where I want to highlight my nose and then I'll just get my beauty blender and blend that out just like that and then it's just like sort of a simple glow not too full on oh my god you know what I forgot blush so we're going to take this Savvy Cheek and Lip Colour. It looks like this. It's in the shade Plush Plum. And I just like to take a bit of this, if I can freaking open it, and put it there. Just like that. Just like so. Before I put on any mascara, I like to take the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray and use it to set my face. So I've got my eyelash curler, curl my eyelashes, and then I like to take the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara. And then after I do that mascara, I like to take this Ulta 3 Volume and Curl Mascara and it's a bit dried out, but I really, really like the wand. It kind of separates the lashes okay and this is probably going to be a bit like controversial but I like to go back in with my eyelash curler and curl them again now that they have some product on them listen don't do this if you're skeptical about it oh my god I, how can you take this seriously don't do it if you're skeptical about it I've been doing it for quite a while and it hasn't done anything to my eyelashes as I know of yet but I just find that it makes my eyelashes stay like, like up for the longest time. For my lips, I would normally just like put on a lip balm or something. But my lip balm that I normally use is downstairs. So, what can I use instead? Okay, well, if I don't use um, lip balm, I'll use this, uh, I just like studded then. This Jeffree Star liquid lipstick in Celebrity Skin. How cute is it? It's so mini. This is what I use most times if I'm going somewhere and I want my lips to look a bit better. But yeah. So that brings us to the end of the video. If you did like it, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe down below. I don't know if people want to see makeup things. Um, I know a lot of people are subscribed to me for like food and um, like Kmart hauls and stuff, but I thought I'd just incorporate something, test it out test the waters um, and I thought this would be kind of helpful for some people if they were stuck for some new products to try um, these are ones that I've been do I just love my nails <laughs> these are ones that I've been using for a very very long time this combination works for me um, and hopefully some of them can work for you if you decide to go and get any of the products anyway I'm rambling if you did like it subscribe like comment and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.